in the Kundalini rises, it makes sounds, and the sounds that are heard in the different chakras can be pronounced in the following way. These pronunciations are being used in the phonetic language of Devanagari, which means the language spoken by the Devas. At the Muladhara, where there are four petals, the sounds are w, sh, s, s, out of which last sh and s sounds are very close, but the difference is when the snake He says, it makes this show the third sound. So, the sh, sh, s. At the Swadhisthana, where there are six petals, It makes sounds six sounds. The the ma ye. R, L. Manipur, it has ten petals. It makes the sounds D, D, N, T, Th, D, Dh. Na, pa, ha. At Anahata, there are twelve petals. It makes the sounds ha, ha, ga, 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 cha, cha. J, J, Ng, T, T. At the Vishuddhi, where there are sixteen petals, it makes the sounds of all the vowels, a, a, e, e, u, u, r, l, 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 a, i, o, o, u, am, aha. At the Agya Chakra, it makes a sh. At the Sahastrara, one becomes thoughtless. 
I know some is made, but the pure anahata, meaning the throbbing, the purest form as in the heart is of lap, tap, lap, tap, lap, tap. When all these sounds are sounded together and pass through the spiral of the body, if the body is like a couch, The sound that comes out of the synthesis is Om. Like the seven colors of the sun ultimately become white rays. Or you can say the golden colored rays. There are three granthis, means the knots, the Brahma granthi, the Vishnu granthi, and the Rudra granthi. With Agni means fire. When the Brahma Granthi meets, between the Kundalini, Muladhara, Chakra, and the Swadhisthana means Muladhara Chakra, Muladhara and Swadhisthana Chakra. Then Agni Brahma Granthi is established. Vishnu Granthi, when mixes up with the Surya, that is between the Nabi and the Chakra, Surya Vishnu Granthi is established. When Vishuddhi and Agya or us met, meet, then Chandra Rudra Granthi is established. Altogether, there are fourteen nadis, 
the names are Alambusi, Mu, Vishodari, Varuna, Hastajiva, Yashasvati, Ashini, Gandhari, Pusha, Shankini, Saraswati, Ida, Pingala, Sushumna. Apart from two chakras, which are Surya and Chandra, there are nine other chakras. Muladhar Chakra, Swadhisthan Chakra, Manipur Chakra, Anahata Chakra, Vishuddhi Chakra, Lambika Chakra. This is also called as Hansaha Chakra. Agya Chakra. Between Agya and Sahasra there are two other sub chakras known as Nag Bindu. So we have Muladhar, Swadhisthan, Manipur, Anahat, Vishuddhi, Lambika, called as Sohon, called as Hansa, Agya, Nag, Bindu, Sahastra. Apart from that, there are nine chakras on the sides, like Sri Lalita. And they have different yoginiya, yoginis means the, the powers, the shaktis guiding those nine. Shakti Pitas or you can call them as Avaran Nama Chakra. The first one is Sri Lalita, the Goddess Sri Lalita. which is the Goddess of Beauty. She is the joy-giving Sarvanandamaya, gives the joy from everything. In every created world, in every particle, in every form, there is a power which gives us joy. This power is the joy, is the power of Sri Lalita. She 
she is called as Mahapurpura Sundar. Para para ati rahasya yogi means para para ati rahasya. The one who knows the secrets. The para para means the one that is beyond of the beyond, the secrets of that area, the one who knows is Sri Lalita who is the yogini. At this stage she is Bindu Sarvanandamaya. She is the dot which is joy giving. Second power or avaran is the enclosure is like a triangle. She is Sarva Siddhi She is the one who gives all the Siddhis. She has got three sides. She is called as Tripuramba. Kameshwari, Vadreshwari, Bhagamalini are the three yoginis. This is another enclosure. The name of the goddess is Tripura Siddha Atiravas, meaning these goddesses know the deep secrets of all the Siddhi. The chakra is called as Sarvarogahara and the enclosure is called as Ashtar. The eight powers are called as Vagadevata means the power of the speech. First is Vashini, means which, which attracts Kameshwari, which excites Mudini, which makes you happy, Vimala, which makes you clean, Aruna, which gives you color on the face. Jaini, which gives you a feeling of victory. Sarveshi, which connects you to everyone. Kaulini is the one which gives you goods. 
and fourth enclosure is called as antardasha. Chakra of this enclosure is called as Sarva Rakshakra, one that protects. The goddess is called as Tripura Malini. The powers are Sarvagya, the one which is all knowing, Sarva Shakti is all powerful. Sarveshwara Prada, giver of all the bounties, Sarvat Jnanamai, knower of all the knowledge, Sarva Vyadhi Vinashini, the destroyer of, of all the diseases, Sarva Dhara Swarupa, the support of all, or all Sarva Papaha. The, the destroyer of all the sins, Sarva Anandaman, the one who makes everyone joyous, Sarva Rakshasar, the one who protects all of them, Sarve Chit Malaprada, the giver of all the halas and fruits, rewards. The fifth enclosure is called as Bahir Dashar Sarvartha Sadha. Bahir Dashar is the name of the enclosure and Sarvartha Sadha is the chakra's name. Tripurakshri is the name of the goddess. She has powers, Sarva Siddhi Prada, she gives all the Siddhis, Sarva Sampata Prada, she is the one who is giver of all wealth, Sarva Priyankari, she is the one who is beloved of all, Sarva Mangalakari, she is the one who gives all that is auspicious, Sarva Kama Prada, the one who gives all our desires, Sarva Dukha Vimochini, the one who is a destroyer of all our pains. Sarva Muttu Shamani, the one who, came, who, who, who pacifies the, the dead. Sarva Vigna Nivarini, she is the one who is the remover of all the hurdles. Sarva Anga Sundari, the one who is all, who makes every side of life happy. Sarva Saukhagya Dayani, the one who is the giver of mm, good fortune. The sixth enclosure is known as Chatur Dashar Sarvasabhag. Tripurvasi is the name of the goddess. Chatur Dashar is the name of the enclosure. And the chakra's name is Sarvasabhag Vidaya. The goddess's name is Tripurvasi. The powers are Sarva Sankshobhini, the one who burns off and Sarva Vibravini, the one who can pervert Sarva Sarva Karshini. One which attracts everything. the one who is the giver of joy. Sarva Samohini, the one who can entice the all. Sarva Stambini, the one who makes everyone alert. Sarva Jabhini, 
सर्व वंश कर कंट्रोलर ऑफ ऑल सर्व रंजन भगवान एंटरटेन्स ऑल सर्व उन्मादी शी इज द वन हु गिव्स ऑल द स्पेशल जॉइस सर्वार्थ साधी द वन हु गिव्स द मीनिंग ऑफ ऑल द थिंग्स सर्व संपत्ति पूर्ण द वन हु गिव्स ऑल द वेल बीइंग सर्व सर्व मंत्रमय द वन हु इज डिसाइडिंग इन ऑल द मंत्रा सर्व दंड क्षयम करी द वन हु हु डिस्ट्रॉयज ऑल द ड्यूअलिटीज ऑफ लाइफ the seven avaran or enclosure is called as ashtadala and the chakra of this avaran is called as sarva sankshobhana kara here she is called as tripura sundar the one who gives the beauty to women to be attractive wives ananga kusuma she smells of many flowers ananga mekhala the one who has the solid like a rock in the family ananga madanadi the one who is attractive ananga madanaturadi the one who gives desire to meet Ananga Rekha Devi, the one which draws the different boundaries. Ananga Vegini Devi, the one which gives you speed. Ananga Akusha Devi, the one who gives power of Akusha. the controlling of man ananga malini the one which is very gracious enclosure is called as shobhashadar the name of the chakra is sarvasha paripurak the goddess's name is tripureshwari she is the one who has got 16 powers the first is kama means the attraction of body buddhya is the attraction by brain ahankara attraction by ego four shabda attraction by words fifth is parsha attraction by touch sixth attraction by beauty seven attraction by 
aesthetics, rasa, gandha, attraction by fragrance, time, attraction by attention, chitta, ten, dhairya, attraction by courage, eleven, smutya, attraction by memory, twelve, nama, attraction by name, thirteen, is bija, attraction through the sea, forty, atma, attraction by spirit, Attraction by eternity, sixteen. Attraction by the form of the body. These are all the attractions which are subtly uh, and are in the bodies, which act in a way that the Sadaka is attracted to herself. The ninth one is called as the Bhupur. is the enclosure. Why the chakra's name is Trailokya Mohan? Name of the goddess is Tripura. There are ten powers in this chakra. Its first is Sarva Sarangu Shoksa. Samshobhini, Sarvavidravani, Sarvakarshini, these three I have already explained, Sarvavanshakani, one is our Sarvavanshakani, Sarvon Madini, the one who excites her there. Sarva Mahankusha, the one who controls. Here the Ampusha means the uh, the weapon that is used by the elephant driver. So how he controls the elephant in the same way she controls all. Sarva Khechari, one who, who attracts all. Sarva Bija, the one who is the seed in all. Sarva Yoni, the one who exists in all the uh, all the yonis and Sarvati Khanda, the one uh, which exists in all the three uh, dimensions. The yoni means the ellipse, which is the power of the mother. Apart from that, there are other goddesses.
which exist as the yellow light known as Mukta Shaktaya. The mother goddesses are called as Mahendri, Chamunda and Mahalachma. The Siddhis that people can achieve are Anima, Radhima, Mahima, Nishatva, Vashitva, Pratikamya, Bhakti, Icha, Prakti, Mukti. Anima is to become like a small particle. Ladima is to become small. Mahima is to have a big form. Ishatva is to create thoughts out of human beings. Vashitva is the attraction. Prakamya is the manifestation. Bhukti is the enjoyment. Fulfillment of desire. Bhakti is the attainment. Bhukti is the salvation. These are all the seeds that Sahaja yogis can have. 